Hi book nerds, this is Carrie Arcos. Thank you so much to Jean and to everyone who's taking part of the tour for my latest book, Crazy Messy Beautiful. Here she is, yay! I am so excited that this book is finally out in the wild. As I say, it's taken about a two year process, actually a little over two years to get this book to you. It tells the story of a boy named Neruda Diaz, and he's named after one of the greatest love poets in the world, Pablo Neruda. If you have not read any of Neruda's work, I strongly recommend you get online and start there. But he's, um, he's one of my favorites, for sure. But my character, um, even though he's named after this great love poet, he is the unluckiest in love. And so this book kind of um, shows his journey as far as his love life goes. And it's a sweet story. It's a little bit lighter than my other two books. My other two kind of dealt with heavier themes of like drug addiction and grief. And so this is a little bit of a departure for me, but I so enjoyed writing this book. I, I loved um, the characters and the whole process. My main character, my Neruda, is based off of one of my former students. Uh, my first year of teaching, I taught juniors in high school. I taught English. And I had this student who kind of looked like this, you know, tough kid on the outside, but he would walk around carrying this rolled up um, book of poems, and it was Pablo Neruda's 20 Love Poems in a Song of Despair. And I'd never heard of Pablo Neruda, tragically, and so my student was like, oh man, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta read his stuff. And so I started reading his poetry and just fell in love with Neruda myself. And I actually mailed a copy of this book to my former student last week, and so I hope he likes it. We'll see. Um, it's not totally Esteban, just more of like the idea that, you know, as, as boys or as, as men, you can have this romantic soul and sensitivity and still, you know, uh, retain very much of your, your manhood. And I, I, you know, I haven't seen a lot of, in, in, in lit, well, especially young adult literature, this kind of artistic soul, <clears throat> I guess, in, in, that Neruda has. So I hope that you readers enjoy him because, you know, most of the men in my life and the boys in my life, they have this soft kind of romantic heart that a lot of times I don't think gets encouraged, you know, to be revealed to the world. But has great characters. Ezra is another character in this book, and he's one of Neruda's best friends. And there's Grayson, and then there's a girl, of course, named Callie, who Neruda doesn't really know quite what to think of at first. And it's kind of a book about their growing friendship, I guess you could say. And there's, you know, family situation happening, lots of drama, lots of love, lots of art, lots of beauty. Lots of crazy and messy, and I hope you guys enjoy reading it as much as I enjoyed writing it. Thank you so much.